Hey, I'm Colin, and today I'm going to show you a pretty cool reaction. Right here in my hand, under this paper towel, I have a piece of elemental sodium, a metal which is extremely reactive and in one of my other videos, and it's pretty cool because if you throw it in water it'll explode or catch on fire. And here I have iodine, elemental iodine crystals, and um, you can see it's a purplish grayish salt. <laughs> the blob of sodium at the bottom is now orange hot. It's on fire from the iodine. <laughs> Okay, what you can see here is the remnants of the reaction. In the center, that white spot we have there, that is sodium iodide. And that's the chemical that was formed from the reaction. Around that, the purple mush we have is wet iodine. So when I drop another piece of sodium in it, the reaction will proceed very, very quickly. So I'd step back, Kyle. Huh? Stir it all up. By increasing the contact between the two chemicals, I can speed up the rate of the reaction. Although this is a little bit scary because we could get a little bit of splatter here. is why we have protective equipment. Okay, so 
The white cloud you saw there was the vaporized sodium iodide, a salt that was vaporized from the heat of the reaction. And we probably have a little bit of sodium left in there, as well as a little bit of iodine. But besides that, it's mostly sodium iodide and water. The heat from the reaction has cracked the Pyrex that I contained it in. 